Do you use boards within your monday.com account that you're always reusing? Like maybe a project board that you need to create for every single project. Let me show you how you can make templates that you can reuse so you do not need to make a board from scratch every single time. This will maintain consistency within all your boards and save you time. Hi, my name is Tara and I'm a certified monday.com partner. My goal is to make Monday the best part of your week. If you need help with a custom implementation, my contact details are in the description below. So let's jump in to today's tutorial. So here you can see I have a board that I've called Project Board Template. Now this is a board that I want to replicate over and over again because every single time I have a project, I want to be able to use this board. While I simply can go in and just duplicate this board, just hit duplicate, there actually is an easier way to do this to make this a template board. Now, what you need to do is you need to make sure that this is a main board and you can tell by this icon over here showing you that it's a main board. And what I would do is click on these three dots and then click as save as templates. Then I just have to hit this blue button and it's gonna save it as a template. Now you'll notice a few things happen. Number one, it added this like magic wand over here, the icon on the board itself so you know it's a template. And number two, I have this gray banner over here telling me that this is a template. This banner wants to warn me that if I make future changes to this board, any future boards that are created will have those changes. So let's just say I made a board today using this template and I had the word tasks up here. This group in this board will be called tasks. Now let's just say tomorrow I decide that I want to update this color so that way it's green. Now the next time I make another board, this group is going to be green. It's not going to update any past boards that I've ever created, but it will update any future boards that I created. Now, if you want to make a template, you click on this plus button and I click on choose from templates. And you can see here on the left side, I have templates created in your account. And here I have my project board template. Now, if I click on it and just click use template, it will create another board. Now, what I want to show you is that you can actually automate this process pretty easily if you need to constantly recreate a template. Now, here I have a project overview. And just to understand a little bit about the workflow, what happens is I have this project overview, which is a, basically a list of all of my projects. And each project will have a project board. So you can see that the project, this one is called test, is connected to the lower level project board. Now, I created a status column called action buttons. And my action button, I've renamed it create template board. So the first thing is you have to have a trigger for creating your template. In this case, I did a status. Then I need to go to my automations and I'm gonna add a new automation. And I'm gonna write when status changes to something and I'm gonna choose when my action button column changes to create template, I am going to create a template, a board from a template. Now I'm going to choose on a board. And if you click this arrow, you can choose which board you want. So here's the name of my template, project board template. And you can also decide, first you have to decide the name. So let's say I actually, in this case, I want it to be the name, the item name that I've assigned the item to be. You can also decide if you want it to be a main board, a private board, or a shareable board. If you clicked on the advanced down here, you can decide which folder you want it to be in. So I have tons of folders here, so I'm gonna click it in my, put it in my demo boards. You can automatically choose board owners and board subscribers, just saving you time every single time you need to do this. I'm gonna click done, and I'm gonna click create automation. Now I actually had another one, so I'm just gonna turn that off, and now let's test it. So I'm gonna add a new project. Let's just call this project number one. And I am going to click this button to create a template. And now let's go over to our left side and we are going to wait for this board to be created. See, project number one was created. Now let's just review what this one looks like. You can see, remember I have the groups in green. You can see all these different columns. If I go over here to project one, you can see that I have the exact same thing. So every single time I hit that button, create template, I'm going to have the exact same board created. So this is a way that you can easily automate the creation of templates. 
I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. If you did, click the like button below. Make sure to subscribe so you can receive tips and tricks on how to use monday.com.